Am I being bored? God damn it. <laughs> this is Tokyo Shadow. Tokyo Shadow, huh? Oops, so, you'll learn why I bought this game once you see the cover. Oh! Look. Look at her. That's Tokyo Shadow. She's gonna kick your ass, and then she's gonna shoot you. Okay, now look at the back. <laughs> Dude, look at that. <laughs> Hold on. So cool. Red lightning. She will strike you dead with blood lightning. That's amazing, folks. That is so... So far, all I know about this game is that it's published by Taito. It's called Tokyo Shadow. Yes. And, uh, yeah, it stars that menacing-looking lady on the front. Let's have a look. See what this game's all about. Okay, there's one other thing I know about this game. Uh, Taito published 22 games for the Sega Saturn in Japan. This is the only one that's not an arcade port. The I... only one. That's kind of incredible. Yeah. So we're going to see what the hell this is all about. God's mad. <laughs> Not nearly enough FMV adventure games came out over here in the States. Those were all for Japan. And that was a legit subgenre back then. I... FMV plus adventure game equals big money. I love this subgenre, by the way. So much so that even Taito got up in on the action, releasing exactly one game to test the waters in the adventure game market before deciding, ah, we're going to go back to arcade ports. We're Tokyo Shadow number one. And our name is... Uh, my name is Dave. Hey, Dave. Never tell Tokyo Shadow your real name. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Huh? Tokyo, 2169. The streets. Uh... The streets are streets. <laughs> the streets are streets, folks. Plane got shut down, shot down over the uh, the Shinto shrine. There, it looks like. Okay. 
Annie, what the fuck is this? I don't know. <laughs> I, I feel bad. I. If you get games for your import Sega Saturn, you're gonna end up with a lot of junk that you don't know what it is or how to play it. Or in this case, j games that just look cool but aren't really accessible to you as a non-Japanese speaker. We gotta help him. This is a very dark game, too. It, it kind of is, yeah. それは京子。それは京子からの電話だった。うん。いいよ。僕が彼女と付き合い始めたのは今から4年前。高校2年の夏だ。高校のとこ学校の廊下があって。その後僕は大学に進学したけど、京子は警察官に。そしてこの春念
Interesting. So oh, a supernatural it thriller then. Also, uh, I found the dog mentioning this game's kind of similarity to Suzuki Baku Pods. It is, yeah. Same sort of presentation. Not nearly as artful. Should also mention this was the very last game by this developer. For which? This developer originally started out as a creator of games for the Laser Active. <laughs> they produced games like Pyramid Patrol and uh, Virtual Cameraman, which I think we've covered before. Oh, yeah, I think we have. But this is their very last game. I guess Taito funded it and it wasn't enough to save them. And like many games of this type, it goes like this. You watch some cutscenes, then you make a choice, and depending on what you choose, the story goes in a different branch. Is she trying to make us go to the witch store? Because that's cool. Let's go to the witch store. Is that what she, or is it like a witch concert? What is it? What, what is she the witch concert. Out? Tell me, tell me. Let's find out. Okay. She's, ad according to Trap of Luxury, she's advertising for Magic Kitchen uh, Megiddo Megiddo. I fucking... Oh, it is it. a witch thing. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Danny, hack the game and understand Japanese perfectly so we can do this. <laughs> Let me enable English. Yeah. Oh, we're Hide. Okay. Yeah. I thought we'd be playing as the lady. Trying to get her to go somewhere with us, and she's like, no, no, why, no? Uh, let's try this one. Don't be scared. I'm big and strong. I'll beat up all the witches. Any witch steps to you, just let me know. Hmm. Yeah, this is Kyoko with her boss, and uh, she's busy at work because so many people are going missing in uh, Shibuya, and she works with the cops. Hmm. Oh, we pissed her off. She didn't want to go in there. And there's this guy. Try and skip through this. But we may just call it here. Yeah. If you like adventure games with a supernatural tinge, and if you like a witch store, full motion video, Taito, come on. All the makings of a hit game. What? Oh my god! Uh, Well, Annie, what did I do? <laughs> did I choose go to hell? <laughs> You're in the meat verse now, baby. Oh no, I hate the meat circus. <laughs> oh oh what? my god! Am I being bored? God damn it! <laughs> god, oh, it's just a big joke. <laughs> Uh, this guy's... this guy's alien boring us. That's not how I expected this story to go. I think this is the adventure... I, uh, sorry, the retro... this is the Retro Pals. This is the Retro Pals first vor. Yeah. Congratulations, everyone! My first vor. We've just been vored. I did not expect the story to go that way so quickly, and for me to die so quickly. <laughs> I only got like two different choices and I somehow managed the uh, go to hell and get vored option. <laughs> now <laughs> skeletons. Skeletons who got vored. Oh, we're just a skeleton now. Time to join the skeleton horde. Oh <laughs> This took a turn. <laughs> It's Benedict Cumberbatch here. 
下げるんじゃないぞこの通り僕はピンピンしてるああここに来る前のことを思い出してみろほら Absolutely not Oh my god Absolutely not Danny, what the fuck are you making us watch? I don't know. 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 I don't Oh, hey, I didn't bring up the fact that it could be anal vor, all right? I didn't go that far. <laughs> However, there is evidence to support that. I made the wrong choice. Boy, did I ever. That lady did not want to go into the witch store. Also, did you and know we know are why. a ghost? We're a ghost? Yes, also we're a ghost. And we help that lady solve crimes. Good. And we made the wrong choice, so we're back in the death zone or hell or whatever. I see, that's what happened. Yeah, thanks. Oh my god, we were being lectured on being a shitty ghost, which sounds like the story of my life, yeah. honestly, yeah. Can't even be a good ghost. Well, it looks like we're in the dead zone. We are a ghost skeleton. Also, uh, this game got a PS1 release as well. Oh yeah, it did. It was also ported to PS1. Uh, let's see if I can bargain with the devil, see if I can get my... My body back. Oh wait, no, now we're becoming the ghost, so no uh, matter what, maybe we did have to be bored. Okay. It was an inevitability. How did you somehow get, you're like, oh, there's a cool lady with a gun on the cover, and it turns into the boar game. It's just, it always happens like that, you know? You never expect it. First play a game by the Cube of War people, now we play the game with the actual Vore. <laughs> I don't I don't even know what we're going to be doing next, but I'm, I'm gonna choose to... the option that says to ho ho. Same. Satan likes it when you laugh at him, right? Yeah. Oh, I still need to play Ghost Trick one of these days. Yeah, oh man. Uh, thanks. The reserve lets us know that the game was devved by High Tech Labs. Yep, Japan. that's them. Cool. The Laserdisc uh, people. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Famous for Pyramid Patrol. Oh my god, they did Pyramid Patrol! Mm -hmm. Holy moly. And yeah, I assume at this point, uh, a lot of people, the whole Laserdisc expertise thing was not high in demand by the time this game was made. They were just trying to make do with what they had. And with their area of expertise, that translates to FMV Adventure Game. And it's a shame they weren't more successful, because this looks technically competent. It's got some really messed up looking stuff in here. Are we being redeemed? Are we getting unvored? Yeah, we're getting- look at this. Jesus, unvore me. You can cut that out of the, the archive, too. <laughs> well, folks, thanks for watching the Adventure Pals. The Retro Pals. Retro Pals gravestone. It reads, uh, 2015 to 2017, quote, Jesus, unvore me. Oh my god. Well, this game has suddenly transformed into into a tale of how to escape from hell and how to get your body back on the streets of Tokyo. This ain't Tokyo. I I didn't sign up for this. However, it looks like I we're getting a second Jesus chance. I can't Jesus actually did unbore you. I am going to... Yeah. She was Jesus all along. 
Alright, her this lady's name, uh hold on. Sa Watash to Shuni. Come in a kunini Mari Masho. Hi ho show, huh? Huh. This is what did you choose? Uh, I chose the option that said Sugoi. <laughs> I want to at least be saved before we switch games here. Am I saved? Y'all, I think we got saved! Or did we? I think we're just in Vor Purgatory now. Mmm, Vorgatory. I keep wanting to switch to another game because we got a lot to cover, but this game has me in its grip. I can't. I can't in good this conscience. Game is, you know, so did Joe. Oh, <laughs> Well, now we don't have a choice. Well, folks, we started out as a Tokyo detective, average everyday life, and then we got Vord. We got Vord and we went to hell. Uh, we but got then made fun of by another We got ghost. made fun yeah. of. There was a lot of skeletons. And then we ascended to heaven. The end. Try another story. Oh, buddy. Wow. Wow. That was... I'm glad I have this game. Here's the chapter map. Yeah, you can, uh, this game has a map of all the different endings and paths you can take. Look at all these paths, my god. Ending three. I, I ended the game as quickly as possible. Look at that. <laughs> speed, That's awesome. You totally speed I speed run. ran Tokyo Shadow. You speed run getting bored there. Not even, not even trying. Oh, that's good. Oh my god.